What is going on, you dirty old bags of stash? I'm out at a local glory hole that I haven't been to before, which is kind of kind of weird for here. Every lake that's around me, I've pretty much put in a video, but uh, I can't think of a time that I actually made a video here. So I figured, what the hell? Might as well come out here. Obviously, there's plenty of people, so there must be some fish. Old boys over there said they were catching crappie the other day. I'm not really gonna go for crappie right off the bat. I might have to eventually out of des desperosity, des desperate, desperity. If I get desperate, I might try for crappie, but as of right now, I'm gonna go out, throw some moving baits, some jerk baits, some uh, lipless crank baits, uh, maybe some square bills. See if I can't piss something off. It's nice and cloudy, warm, windy. So I ain't gonna do none of that slow shit. And most of the time I don't do the slow shit anyway, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna catch. I'm gonna try to catch some bass. There's walleyes in here. So I've actually never caught a walleye out of here though, but people say there's walleyes in here. Catch a walleye, that'd be cool. If we can catch some bass, that'd be cool too. I don't know. Don't have very high standards for myself or this fishing trip, so come along with me. Let's go see what the hell I can catch. Let's do this shit. I've been struggling lately at the local community shitholes that I normally fish, so I figured I might as well come to this right out of town local community shithole. It's a pretty good lake. It's pretty big fish, big bass, big of a lot of things. So I figured it was worth a worth a dangle, worth a test, worth a violation. But yeah, let's see if we can actually catch something. Besides a duck, because I just threw out a duck. Been kind of a struggle out around here lately, so I'll really take anything I can get. That ain't a bluegill. Freaking walleye. No way. Well, that's not a crappie. Oh yeah. Nice. Are you allowed to keep them out here? You think that's 15? Cool. First fish just got started, second cast. And I guess we're doing a walleye catch and cook maybe. Box is 12 or 10. It's definitely 15. Well, wasn't going for walleye. But I'll take him, I suppose. So far, the new lake that I haven't fished for a while is uh, paying off. It's going for bass, but now we're gonna do a little wally catch and cook. It's pretty sweet to get a walleye damn near second cast, so by damn near, I mean second cast. Now we're gonna spend the rest of the day seeing if we can get another one. Usually if there's one around, there's more around. And that was literally the first rock patch that I threw down, and there's plenty of rocks. and trash plenty of trash too like i said right out of town community shithole obviously is going to be filled with people filled with trash and hopefully filled with dirty old walter heads who knows i might have caught the only one left in here if that were the case i'd feel like a dick because i kept them i don't really feel that bad because i never really keep them but today is the day kind of hungry anyway i have to go home and cook them sooner and later sorry excuse me I just want to get around you. Uh, uh, Alright, I just want to fish. <laughs> Look at that dickhead. <laughs> yeah, there's eggs. Alright, dickhead, I'm sorry. Thing scared the shit out of me. That's not a walleye. Little bassy? <laughs> yep, little baby bass. This is what I was expecting to catch on a jerk bait here. Oh yeah. It's ten, 10 inch bass. Giant. Well, it was already worth risking my life. Walking past a goose to catch that 10 inch bass. Another one. That was bigger, but he's just hooked weird. Batter. Little belly. Cool. Where's the walleye is that? Time to walk back past the old dickhead goose. Everyone be quiet. Look at his greasy little tongue sticking out. All right, all right. All right, I get it. I don't really like you either. Just bounce some shithole jetty to shithole jetty. 
See if we can't get some dinner. Well, so far this jetty sucks balls. Old bud down there has caught some fish. No walleyes though. Yeah, keep trying. Probably go over yonder way to the dam and try there, I suppose. Since walleyes are supposed to be on the dam and stuff, today's turned into a walleye mission. Dams are big and scary, and I don't like fishing them. I'm just kidding, I'm not scared, but dams are big, and they're kind of hard to figure out because they're just straight line rock, and there's pretty much nothing in between. But supposedly, walleyes are supposed to go on the dam in the spring, so we're gonna go down there and try it for a little bit. We're in desperation mode. I'm trying to get one more walleye. Let's see if we can do it. Those guys appear to be going for Walter heads on the boat and stuff. That doesn't sound half bad. Walking down the rocks, Probably gonna hurt myself. Stay tuned for the shocking conclusion after this ad. All right, we're back. Still walking down the dam. Nothing's changed. Still got one walleye. Two little bass. Fishing's been so shitty around here. I'll literally take anything I can get. It's a crappie that bites my crankbait. I'm cool with that. Anything. Try by this spilling ways. There's so many damn weeds. Wish I had a plastic. Yes, I do. I have to go up and try something different. <clears throat> Get a different Lou hair. Can't even finish a cast with all these nasty, smelly, stinky weed bitches. Look at these little bastards. Little mini swim baits and an underspin. Let's see if that doesn't get bit. I'm actually gonna throw it on my spinning rod. Leave it on the edge. I throw this down the dam for an hour. Or until I lose it. Then I'm gonna go home and clean that slut of a walleye. I'm gonna try a new recipe. Getting fancy with it. That is a fish. <clears throat> Not a walleye though. Little bassy, but my God, that thing freaking demolished it. Well, I caught a fish on the dam. That's an accomplishment in itself. Not a Walter head though. This thing's actually pretty badass. Little. Six cents swim bait, six, six cents uh, underspin. Got chomped, I'm gonna retie the lines all frayed and shit. You don't want that. Don't forget, coupon code stash, six cents.com, blah, 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 pa pow. Go buy yourself some. Stupid walleye, it's dead, still trying to move. Well, ideally, I would have liked to have catch, caught, catched, catched, caught more than one walleye but i caught one second cast and then i caught a bunch of bass after that not sure how many of the bass i'm going to include but I'll include a few of them i guess just to make this video worth a shit but got a walleye got myself a nice little lunch even though he fell on the ground and he's dead doesn't matter i'm gonna kill him and clean him anyway oh you can't see that yet tried the rest of the day tried to uh catch another walleye and uh was actually trying to limit out i had high hopes after the second cast fish but they all kind of went to shit, so. I've always wanted to try this. I've kind of tried it. I've done it with regular, regular Funyuns, but got flaming hot fun yons that I'm gonna use as batter. I don't know. I'm gonna mix like 50% flour with 50% smashed up flaming hot Funyuns. Use 50% uh, walleye. That equals 150%, so it doesn't make any sense, but we're gonna do walleye, dip it in eggs, then Funyuns with some flour. Let's see how it turns out. Sounds like it could be pretty good, but who the hell knows? I've never done it before. I'm gonna try it now. Let's do this thing. All right, so we got our pan. We got maybe enough vegetable oil. Hmm. Not really. That's all right. We'll make do unless there's more. There's not more. So I guess we'll just spray a bunch of pan in there or something. I don't know if it's the same, but probably gonna get a lot of comments about this. This is basically like butter, isn't it? I don't know. Pam and vegetable oil. Send her to about a medium heat, and we'll get that hot. All right, so we got yield walleye. Probably turn this down, because it's gonna take me 87 years, because I suck at cleaning fish. Yield walleye. Yield KVD knife. Thanks, Kevin. You're the best. Cut down the side. Knife's dull. Pa pow. Sure, some people just cut down the bone, but cut down the side, come to the top. Try to get as close to the bones as possible. Take it down to the stink hole. Oh, he's pooping. You think you are coming to my house and taking a shit, Mr. Walla? 
Glad you're dead. Now I'm to almost finishing off the tail. Miss some meat there. If you're uh, coming here to learn how to clean a walleye, you came to the wrong place, buds. Cut down the rib cage. Pop it through the skin. Cut it down. Back to the stinkle. Scooch old Timmy down a little ways. Then you move said skin from said meat. Honestly, for me cleaning this, it actually doesn't look too bad. Boo didn't even have to help me. I mean, it looks edible. All right, fillet number one's done. We're gonna do the same shit to the other side, and then we're gonna, we're gonna start making the batter and stuff. Um, we should probably turn this down before I burn the house down. But yeah, clean the other side, make batter, get the eggs out. Pow pow. I know they look like big long penises. But I had to split them in half because I left some bones in there like an idiot. The fact that these look mildly decent without help from Boo or Dad is nothing short of a goddamn miracle. These are ready to rip. Probably going to cut these in half. The big long dong ones. Shit. A little brief interruption. I had to go get eggs because Boo and I ate all of them this morning. What the hell kind of egg container is this? Look at that dude. Farm fresh brown eggs, yo. No MSGs, gluten free. Ba ba ba, blue blue blue. Who gives a shit? All right, gotta jerk these eggs off quick with a fork. Sounds pretty brutal, I know. You ever jerked off with a fork? I hope not. Old wallet fillets. Need to get in there soaking. Yeah, now we got our onions. We need to break up. I'm gonna eat some too. Guess we're gonna use this hammer. I don't know how you're supposed to break up the onions. Probably in a bag, maybe. Switch into a bag so Boo doesn't freak out because she just cleaned the kitchen this morning. I don't want her cutting my choke off. me about 800 pounds to, to notice. Alright, that took entirely too long, but I think that's about as crunched up as they're getting. Got our flaming Hot Funyun batter. Sure lunch for good measure, because I don't have any uh, flour. It's probably going to hurt more coming out than it is going in. Oh, stop eating them. They're so good. Time to put the wallet, fillets, and in our uh, batter. Try to get it as caked on as possible. That looks pretty caked. I mean, I'm shaking, I'm so hungry. Yep, grease is nice and hot. Dump that in there. Then repeat the process with the rest of them. I'll check back soon. Look at those red dongs just sizzling in there. Mm -mm -mm. Red dongs are the best kind of dongs. I don't know what that means, but it sounded good at the time. A little red dong, a little flip. Hmm, kind of crunchy. Doesn't look terrible. Definitely, definitely could look worse. I've definitely made worse. Bring these little bitches out. Hmm. Shouldn't be too terrible. Doesn't look bad, really. I might actually try this shit again. We'll see after we taste it. All right, so here goes. Red Dong Walleye. Let's break it open, make sure it's even cooked properly. Oh yeah. That looks delicious, really. Could have left it on there a little bit longer, I guess, but... Hmm. I'm honestly going to say... <clears throat> it's a little biased, but... This is the best fish that I've ever made. If you haven't tried it with, like, flaming Hot Cheetos or flaming Hot Funyuns, they're probably better, to be honest with you, because uh, they're a little bit more mild, a little bit easier to break up, probably, even though breaking it up was a pain in the goddamn ass. I don't know. I don't give 10s, but I'd sure as shit give it a 9. Sorry, boo. Sorry I missed this one. The one time I actually cleaned fish good and cooked fish good, you weren't here. Oh well, yeah, that's right, I'm making a video. But yeah, turned out pretty good. Wasn't expecting to catch a walleye, wasn't trying to catch a walleye. Um, I caught a walleye that was too big to keep the other day. 
and I felt bad because I was pregnant, so I let it go. But I was kind of kicking myself in the ass for that because uh, you guys have been requesting walleye catching cooks a lot and just walleye fishing in general. The walleye fishing around here sucks balls, so if you can get one or two of them, most of the time I try to let them go just because there's not that many. But that was a perfect little male. Killed that son bitch, and uh, I'm glad I did because it's delicious. <sighs> the funions are, are key. But if you like this video, Give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe. Let me know what else you want to see this year. Plenty of plenty of open water and stuff left, so just getting started. So if you have any ideas, let me know. I'll try to do some of them. Can't do all of them because you crazy bastards come up with a lot of things that I can't even do. Traveling's hard, so it has to be around here. So if you have any ideas, let me know. Definitely appreciate it. Subscribe if you haven't. Turn on the little bell notification dingy. And uh, yeah, until next time, see you guys eventually here. Actually, two days from now, because I'm posting every two days, so every other day, yo. Alright, that's enough. Goodbye. <laughs>